All right, then. Captain Marvel just arrived. Okay, this is essentially a prequel to how the MCU began. Essentially, with Brie Larson as Carol Devers, otherwise known as Captain Marvel. Sam L. Jackson, Cree... Clark Gregg, uh, back as Nick Fury and Phil Coulson being digitally animated. We also had Ronan Accused in this film, and Jude Law. Those move, those two were really, really satisfying in that ep. Okay, this movie was... Good, I guess. I mean, it's not as groundbreaking as the solo films of what came before. Okay, so if I had to weigh this up against the new solo outings of this. Okay, uh, better than Ant-Man and better than Guardians of the Galaxy because I hate Guardians of the Galaxy. Yes, shoot me. Uh, not as good as Iron Man 1. Definitely nowhere near as good as Captain America First Avenger. Definitely better than Spider-Man Homecoming. Not as good as... Kind of level with Doctor Strange and the Incredible Hulk. I know what you're... Now, you're wondering... You're probably wondering what the hell that means. Okay. This movie was decent, though it kind of does feel like a little bit of a filler for Avengers Endgame. Brie Larson is a pretty cool actress, I must must admit. Never deny that. She, she is worth the time. Oh, sorry. There were a few moments in this movie that I didn't like. I mean, the bit where Nick Fury loses his eye, that's a little bit crazy. That being said, the effects on Clark Gregg and Samuel L. Jackson were pretty stellar. I mean, like, they digitally aged them. <laughs> Another big issue, i say, is... This film didn't have enough nuance going with it, and it sort of felt like style over substance. I mean, there were a few things I would have liked done a little bit better, like uh, mostly part of the suit. But hey, this is the first female front for the MCU. I'm thinking it probably would have been better off if it was Black Widow. But we'll get to that. And I really do wish that movie was R-rated. So that being said, Captain Marvel will probably be a fun time for you. It's not good, it's not bad, it's not awful. It's not a game changer. It's a Marvel movie. And as Movie Bob rightly said, stop turning these things into homework. Watch them for Christ's sake. I'm going to give Captain Marvel a B-. So guys, thank you so much for watching. I cannot wait for Avengers Endgame. Don't you dare miss it. As always, be sure to like, share and subscribe. You guys are the best. Peace, Nate, are out. Cut the check.